Hello. Welcome to my channel. In this lecture, we'll go over the triangulate modifier. This modifier basically converts all faces in a mesh to triangular faces. This is very useful when exporting model to other software. Especially for game engines. As you know, game engines triangulates your mesh to calculate easier. But they can triangulate your mesh differently than Blender does. It can cause issues. So, that's why it's sometimes best to triangulate your mesh before exporting. Let's press Shift A and add a monkey head. Go to Modifier menu and add Subdivision Surface Modifier. Apply the modifier. Let's enable the wireframe mode to see our mesh faces. As you can see, our mesh consists of quad faces. Let's add triangulate modifier. There we go. All quad faces have been converted to triangle faces. We can change quad methods. The shortest diagonal method splits the quads based on the shortest diagonal length. The beauty method splits the quads in nice triangles. The fixed method splits the quads on their first and third vertices. The fixed alternate method splits the quads on their second and fourth vertices. Let's add cylinder and set the vertices number to 8. As you can see, our top and bottom faces are n-gons. They are 8-sided polygons. Let's add triangulate modifier. As you can see, it converts our polygon face to triangles faces. There are two n-gon methods. The first one is beauty method which arranges the new triangles nicely. The second one is the clip method. It splits and gons using an ear clipping algorithm. If a polygon greater than or equal to minimum vertices number, it will be triangulated. If not, it will remain as polygon. For example, if we set the minimum vertices number to 5, side faces of the cylinder will remain as quads. Because side faces have only 4 vertices and not greater than 5. If we set to 9, our top and bottom faces also won't be triangulated. The Keep Normals option here tries to preserve the same shading as before triangulation when using custom normals. Let's add a new monkey head and add triangulate modifier. As you can see, it has different shading from original mesh.
Let's press Tab key and go to Edit Mode. Click on the Mesh menu and select the Split Custom Normals. Now, when we enable the Keep Normals option, it will preserve original mesh shading. Thanks for watching. See you in the next tutorial.